edge detection so what is edge edge are significant local changes of intensity in an image it's typically occurred on the boundary between two different regions in an image we can also say that sudden changes of discontinuity in an image are called edges significant transi transitions in an image are called as edges so what is the goal of edge detection there are two types of goal of edge detection primary and secondary most of the shape information of an image and is enclosed in edges so first we detect these edges in an image and by using these filters and then by enhancing those areas of images which contain edges sharpness of the image will increase and the image will become clearer to produce a line drawing of a scene from an image of the scene that is the main important goal of edge detection our important features can be extracted from the edges of an image for example corners lines curves these features are used by higher level computer vision algorithm for example image segmentations region separations object detection object recognition object descriptions so types of edges basically there are four types of edges step edge ramp edge line and roof so here we can see in the diagram this is the line edge ramp uh, line edge ramp edge uh, roof edge and uh, step edge is just a simple or a small step so the four st basic steps of edge detections are smoothing enhancing detection and localization so in smoothing we suppress as much as nice as possible without destroying the true edges and the second step enhancement we apply a filter to enhance the quality of the edges in an image for example sharpening and third step detection we determine which edge pixel should be discarded as nice and which should be retained usually uh, thresholding provides the criteria using for the detection the last step which is localization determine the extract location of an edge edge thinning and linking are usually required in this step so next step is there are uh, as we know that uh, there are uh, some uh, edge detection techniques for example sobel operator privet operator kenny operator so here we will discuss the true operator uh, two operator first one is privet operator privet operator is usually for edge detection in an image edge detects two types of edges horizontal edges and vertical edges edges are calculated by using the difference between corresponding pixel intensity of an image all the masks that that are used for the edge detection are known as derivative mask because as we have started many time before that image is also a signal so changes in a signal can only be calculated using differentiation so that's why these operator are also called derivative operator or derivative mask so the mask of private operator private operator provides us two masks one for the detecting of edges in horizontal direction and another for detecting edges in vertical direction above mask will find the edges the in vertical and horizontal direction because and it's because the zeros columns are if the zeros columns are in vertical direction then it will find the edges in vertical direction and if the zero column are the zero uh, are in row direction are in uh, row direction then it will find the edges horizontally so for the first uh, mask when we apply this mask on the image at prominent vertical edges it simply works like as first order derivative and calcul calculate the difference of pixel intensity in a edge region as the center column is zero so it does not include the original value of an image but rather it calculate the difference of right and left pixel values around the edge this increase the edge intensity and it become enhanced comparatively to the original image the second mask will prominent the horizontal edge image in an image it will work on the principle of above mask and calculate difference among the pixel intensity of the particular edge as the center row of the mask is consist of zero so it does not include the original values of edge in an image but rather it calculate the difference of the above and below pixel intensity of the particular edge 
thus increasing the sudden change of intensity and making the edge more visible both the above mask follow the principle of derivative mask both mask have opposite sign and them and both have sum equal to zero the third condition will not be applicable in this operator as both the above mask are standardized and we cannot change the value and them so all the derivative masks will have the following properties opposite sign should be present in the mask for example as we see in this mask here is minus one so at the right side here plus one here above minus one then below plus one the second one is sum of the mask should be equal to zero sum of the all values of the mask should be equal to zeros and more weight means more edge detection that means that if I increase the weight of this values for example I replace the one with four minus four minus four minus four zero 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 and four 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 then more edges will be detected so now it's time to see these masks in action here is the simple picture on which we will apply the about two masks one time by time so after applying vertical mask here is the vertical edges now applying horizontal mask on the above simple image following image will be obtained as you see that in the first picture on which we apply vertical mask are the vertical edges are more visible than the original image similarly in this picture we have applied the horizontal mask and in result all the horizontal edges are visible so in this way you can see that we can detect both horizontal and vertical image edges from an image so the next one is sobel operator the sobel operator is very similar to the private operator it's also have a derivative mask and is used for the edge detection like the private operator sobel operator is also used to detect two kind of edges vertical edge detection or uh, edge detection in vertical direction and edge detection in horizontal direction but the difference between private and sobel operator what is the difference between private and sobel operator the difference is their mask so uh, as we see in the uh, sobel operator uh, uh, here this was minus one but in the sobel operator there will be minus two this mask they work more ex this mask works exactly as same as private uh, vertical and horizontal mask there is the only one direction that has two and minus two values in the center of first and third column and rows when applied on the image this mask will highlight the vertical and horizontal edges so this give more weightage to the pixel values around the edge region this increase the edge intensity and it's become more enhanced comparatively to the original image Thank you.